I, I come from a rather unusual family uh, in this sense. Both of my grandmothers were Afrikaners. Both of my grandfathers were um, uh, from you know, English uh, descendants. And it's sometimes, you know, when you meet those Italian-Irish families or Jewish Christian families and you've got two in each, I think the fact that I didn't come from all one side or all the other made probably brought my parents together. But I, kept, I lived in a very um, typical uh, white family. Um, I grew up in a very, very tiny um, town, in a way. And my only interaction, I mean, my only interaction with black South Africans was our servants. Um, and I haven't seen the maid, but I suspect that relationships are not that different. Um, I never knew, I never called any black South African by their uh, full name, and I probably didn't call them by their correct name because the standard operating procedure, at least where I was growing up, was somebody would come and, and ask to be employed, and if her name was, you know, Mampela Ramfela, who's a great friend, you know, the white um, woman of the house would say, that's too big, difficult, we'll call you Jane. So I grew up knowing Janes and Johns and Marys and um, just, I mean, that, that was all. I knew nothing about their families, knew nothing, didn't know whether they were married. Had absolutely no interaction whatsoever. Uh, black South Africans lived over there in a separate place.